So hey guys, a bit of a different take on an ASOS haul video for you today. So if you're intrigued by my little video idea, then stay tuned. <laughs> it's Becky and welcome to my channel um, hello if you're new hello if you're a regular uh, thank you so much for joining me today I do plus size fashion beauty lifestyle videos so if that sounds like your cup of tea then hit that big red subscribe button look something like my little cushion uh, down below don't forget to hit the bell hit the likes do all the comments <laughs> all that jazz also you can follow me on instagram tiktok and like to know it where you can shop my wardrobe it's all at becca wren and uh, all items will be linked down below they are affiliated um, so that just means you don't pay any extra but the retailers will give me a little kickback for sending uh you their way <laughs> and obviously that helps my channel um because yeah these are really really expensive because everything looks well not everything but a lot of things look really cute on and then I want to keep them so, <laughs> yeah <laughs> you guys know you guys know um so let me tell you a little bit about today's video because it's a little bit different to the norm so I noticed on the ASOS um app that they had this section it was quite you have to like scroll quite far down but it's basically the algorithm has picked a selection that they think that i would like so asos have actually picked this haul today um, i thought it'd be really interesting to kind of see what they think i would like based off what i've bought in the past um and yeah, there were some cute things, some things I was a bit like, mm. um, but yeah, it just obviously is taking me out of my comfort zone a little bit, picking things that I wouldn't have picked maybe um, before. So yeah, giving you guys some, some new things to look at for me to try. Yeah. Also, there's a couple of very special dresses in this bag, which I'll give you like a sneak peek at, but the video might be up. It might not be but you can probably guess what the video is for so here's here's one part of the dress can you tell what the video is going to be sequins ah exciting not where not doing a try on of that today i also have a second option oh my god oh i'm probably gonna have to wear both this is gorgeous oh my god you have to if it's if it's out i'll link it if it's not out you'll just have to subscribe won't you <laughs> so anyway um here is the first piece it is pink so we're starting off good because i love wow that was loud i love pink rosy pink it is so flattering so pretty um and this is a very cute little dress this is very sweet and I could see myself liking it. <laughs> I could. Uh, it feels really, really nice quality as well. It feels like a cotton. It's a Brodelay Anglais um, type material, as you can see. It's kind of got these little like eyelets all over the dress and there is no slip. So it's very risque. I'm gonna have some skin on show, which like, you know, I don't mind. You can always like, you could maybe wear this as like a cover up even. Um, and it has got, are these real? Oh, they're like fake buttons, but they've even made like the little eyelet, the little eyelet to make it look real. Oh, that's so cute. And they go all the way to the waist. Just a very cute little dress, little frillies down here on the bottom. I did get this in a 24 and I think this feels like 100% cotton. Yeah, 100% cotton. Um, I think ASOS have started us off nicely um yeah let's try this on so i thought this is gonna be a little bit cuter on than it is it's kind of giving me like um what are they what are they called flamenco dancer but like, shorter it's this it's because it the this little like ruffles coming 
just under my dum dum. And um, yeah, it's weird. I think if this was a fit and flare with these nice sleeves, I think a lot of people would like it. But this, <sighs> just cut to slim line, isn't it? Yeah. I think it just needs to. It had quite a lot of potential. Mm -hmm. But I think on me it's fallen a little bit flat, especially because I love this colour pink. But also, you can see right through it, so you could probably all sort of see my black underwear. <laughs> the black try on panties! <laughs> yeah. I think this, I think this is a no ASOS, no comprende. We do not like this. <laughs> So, I've got a big black thing here. This is a sheared cami midi sundress. I think I remember it now. I um, thought this was an interesting choice. Quite simple. Oh, very simple. <laughs> it is just a black maxi with some ruffly tears and like a nice stretchy and some quite nice thick straps with some like ruching detail on very very simple it does look quite big there's a lot of material here um i got this in a 24 but i feel like i could say you could definitely size down and it wouldn't i don't think matter to be honest it is a huge volume of material um, I think it's 100% cotton again. Yes, 100% cotton. Um, mm, mm, <laughs> I don't know how I feel about this dress. I feel like it's very, very dark, obviously, it's black. But also, like, it's going to be really big. Like, it's going to be a lot of black fabric. Um, we'll have to see how it looks on, won't we? But... Yeah, I'm not gonna judge too much. I'm not gonna judge too much until I try it on. I have many things to say about this. I feel like I'm Queen Victoria on holiday. I feel like I'm in a Scottish widow's advert. <laughs> it's a lot. <laughs> it's nice, but it's also, it's a lot. This is a lot of material. I think you could actually make like a six birth tent out of this. Um, <laughs> yeah, it's... I think it's quite nice actually, Rebecca. I could see that with some nice jewellery, some statement type. I think it's just a lot there. If you're on holiday, Netflix. it's hot. Yeah. This is a yeah. lot of black material. Right, yeah. And also I just feel like, I know people like a maxi dress, but you know, is it, is it heavy? It's not heavy, but it's also like I think if it was really hot today is a miserable day. It's actually quite cold for June, and I'm not affected by it. If it was like that heat wave when it was hitting almost thirty, I wouldn't touch this. It'd just be too. It's quite. It's the other extreme of some of the other dresses where they didn't use enough fabric. No. In this one, they've obviously much. decided. To to use all the fabric. Mm. <laughs> I, I, still, I still think it's quite nice. I think, I don't know. Okay. I sure. Know. Here's the smocking. <laughs> quite nice detail. Like almost like a pleated Shoot. strap. But there is a lot you'd have to, I think, trim off. Like there's a lot of raw hemage. Mm. And that's also down here. I don't know. I feel like for the plus size, uh, community <laughs> there's an abundance of maxi dresses mm. and i just don't think that this one i think there could be nicer maxis out there it's okay it's just so black <laughs> so much black Ooh. i don't know but if you like it go for it <laughs> So this is a top that I don't think I'd have ever picked up and this definitely forced me to pick it because I was very curious by it. It's a little kind of cropped wrap top, quite trendy in the kind of straight size world. Um, so 
loved the lemon color very bright very summery and it's got these gorgeous little um red and purple flowers and little i think they call this lettuce hemming on the sleeve one thing i've noticed an awful lot of asos's own brand um that they're pushing in the um the if we think you'd like it section um which is interesting it has got a little a little tie um around it so i guess it's a it's a bit of a mock wrap um it is cropped but not like super super cropped so i think if you've got some high waist shorts or jeans i think you would be okay um very very stretchy very soft material again you've got lettuce hem as well here on the bottom and this is 95 percent viscose and five percent elastane got this in a 24 again um i feel like it, you could probably get away with a smaller size just because it's so stretchy jersey type material but love the color very different for me though i don't think i would have picked this without doing this video so let's try it on um so here is this little top so as i said it's not croppy crop but it's definitely like you definitely need to wear like a high waist jean if you don't want to show any skin but this is very different for me i don't think i would have ever picked this out for myself it's very very bright and fun and quite youthful in design um but yeah i really like the color yellow actually it's very bright and bold here's the print all the beautiful little flowers on it flattering top you yeah know, the a line coming across well, we do like a v-neck we've yeah. been discussing on this channel about how we all love v-necks mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. um and then also this isn't a real wrap which i prefer like it's all sewn in place so you don't have to worry um about like if you can imagine if you were carrying shopping in and then it starts unraveling like what you do <laughs> So uh, yeah, I prefer that. We'll just say with the lettuce hem, you do kind of get a little bit of rolling. Like I have a tiny little bit of, of the fabric rolling up a little bit. That's my only gripe with it really. But I do think it's really, really pretty. And I actually really love long sleeves. I, for whatever reason, I just find them quite like tactilely nice. <laughs> That's a tongue twister. <laughs> so yeah, really, really soft. Um, just so you know, these jeans are also from ASOS and um, I will link them down below if you're interested. Now, this dress, again, again it's something I would never have picked, um, but I thought like that is obviously the point of this video. Um, but it is gingham. I feel like I've been buying a lot of gingham because it's been quite trendy. Um, this is very similar to the black um, maxi dress but it's shorter. So we've got a sheer top up here with literally the same type of like ruched straps, very generously sized. And then you've just got this kind of ruffle tiered. It's kind of the same, except they've just cut it off <laughs> at the bottom. Um, so yeah, very similar style, but shorter, which I do like a short dress. You know that guys. Um, I did get this in 24. Yeah, 24 um <clears throat> yeah it's cute i think i prefer this to the black one um, and this is 100 percent cotton as well asos design again there is i think two two things three things three things that aren't asos i've just pulled out everything that's asos first so yeah this is a really cute little blue gingham check it kind of reminds me of a um school <laughs> school girl dress check that i'd have to wear in the summer but it's cute so this is basically the same as that black dress but in a different print and shorter now if they did that black dress like this i would have absolutely loved it um because i just like showing a little bit of leg i just like a little bit of leg and also <laughs> also i feel like it does make you look a bit smaller because obviously being bigger up top it just you've not got it going all the way down that's just how i see it you kind of it makes you look like you're actually quite small underneath the dress it's just the dress that's the bulk <laughs> so yeah this is really really pretty um really nice little gingham fabric 
very, very comfortable. It is basically like that black dress you've just seen in a different material. Um, yeah, it's really pretty. Nice. <laughs> um, again, same kind of straps, same kind of smocking. Obviously, it comes from the same <laughs> factory. <laughs> They got a bulk deal. So yeah, I personally prefer this blue gingham one to the black maxi. Um, but both of them are super, super comfortable. Um, you could probably, you could probably like go either sizes to be honest. Like if they haven't got your size, you could size down in it because it's so much material. Then we have one of my favorites, plus size brands. It is River Island. Oh. You know I'm a fan. Well, if you didn't know, I'm a fan. I just really like their clothes, and if you can get them in the sale, even better. I think this was actually in the sale. Um, the quality is just really, really nice. Um, really, really cute designs. Flattering, but a bit different. Um, <laughs> watch me say all this and this look shit on me. <laughs> um, it is this really pretty, white dress with gorgeous eyelet detailing nice little cute frilly sleeve there's always lots and lots of details on river island dresses um and then it's got real buttons down the front we've got a little cinched in waist with some tassels and that gorgeous kind of eyelet fabric all over but it is lined which is nice because if you don't want to show your skin this means you can still wear the dress um, but obviously it's not lined on the sleeves it just feels really nice and cool um, i did get this in a 24 the rrp was 40 but i think it was even down to like 27 even um but it's just so gorgeous so pretty um and then you've got this beautiful kind of like cut out edge just feels heavy in a good way just feels really nice quality um i'm a big advocate for river island uh this is oh it has got a slip as well i think i've said that already so oh god there's a lot so the shell is 100% viscose and the lining is 100% polyester and the embroidery is 100% polyester okay I don't know what all the little pieces are but it feels really really nice and I really really like it so yeah let's try it on and um, so here is this River Island dress and um, it's quite cute I want to say the underlining is actually quite tight so the dress and also this little we've got a lot of like belly ruffles in this haul where stuff seems to be like landing like right where we don't want it which mm, it's not my favorite river island dress i've ever tried and i say if you do like the style i'd probably recommend sizing up because we have got a bit of pulling here um it is really nice quality though i always love the quality of River Island dresses. You can see you've got like all of this like eyelets. But yeah, maybe if I, it, oh, that's helped. <laughs> oh, I can breathe. <laughs> that's actually helped a lot. <laughs> Probably should have done that to begin with. Oh, that's made a lot of difference, okay. <laughs> Maybe when you um, get this, you should untie the middle bit. Um, <laughs> that's a bit better. <laughs> okay, so now it's a lot looser. Probably don't need to size up at all. Um, hopefully you didn't fast forward me saying that. Uh, yeah, so perfect sizing. Um, yeah, I would just say the material on a warm day, this is gonna be really hot. I'm already feeling a little bit warm in it now. But well, I do think it's really pretty, really cute. So yeah, cute. Uh, so up next, there's just a little t-shirt. I think I've had, I think I've like looked at this quite a few times. Um, I just thought it was kind of cute. <sighs> so much packaging with everything. Uh, this was from Daisy Street. I really like Daisy Street. Their t-shirts are really nice quality. But this feels weird. Mm, I don't like this um, feeling. I'm just gonna say that. So I like some of Daisy Street's t-shirts. 
this these aren't these are like shiny and like rubbery can you hear that i'm making little fart noises <laughs> yeah okay i don't like that at all um i've had some really nice t-shirts from daisy street that don't have this awful like plasticky transfers um the fabric on the material is really nice it's quite like a thick cotton it's just i'm not vibing with the transfer at all um 100 cotton which is great and i feel like they the lengths of their t-shirts are really really nice i got this in a 24 i'd really recommend checking out their t-shirts but not this one i do not like if, that, if this wouldn't bother you then great i love all the kind of like um you know crystals and stuff i don't know much about it myself but i appreciate the aesthetic of it all but i hate 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 the feeling um so yeah just letting you guys know but i'll still try it on for you so you can see the fit of the t-shirts because i think all their t-shirts are the same like fit and quality and style like it feels exactly like my other one like really soft um and like really nice quality but my other one doesn't have a transfer like that like where it's like shiny Mm, yeah so not vibing but i'll try it on for you so it's not often that i take something out of the bag and like instantly dislike it normally i like to try something on to give it the benefit of a doubt but it's just the feeling of these oh <laughs> like little fart noise horrible don't like that at all um i thought the cute gem i thought it was cute but it's just not i don't like how it's been made the t-shirt itself is really nice quality and also a really nice length um i do like daisy street's t-shirts but how this has been made i think obviously they want such vibrant colors and to show all the textures and I'm guessing that just means they have to use this technique, but it just it makes you feel a bit icky, and I don't know why. Um, if, if that won't, if that wouldn't bother you, then go for it. But for me, I wouldn't. I feel like stuff would stick to it. Yeah. So Daisy Street T-shirts, they're cute, but yeah, just have a watch out for what transfer material they're using on the top weird so the last item is from a brand called cotton on and um, so i believe this was the brand was added this year potentially um i've seen it around i think they only got up to a size 24 there which makes me sad because i think really to be inclusive you should really go up to a 28 minimum being 100% honest um but this is I think a beautiful maxi dress but it looks quite straight <laughs> we'll just have to see not judging it straight away but it's this beautiful blue and oh oh no it's just a sh I thought it was a stain I thought it was a stain um it's this beautiful blue and white pattern material very simple we've got some smocking on the back for easy access and we have this gorgeous little tie at the front where you can kind of adjust depending on your boobs i um, also love these ties because you can like really squeeze your boobs in um, and then we've got some really cute puffy sleeves really just wanted to try the brand out and as it was on my items they thought i would like oh okay this is cool um oh yeah, cotton on is an australian brand and um, they use it used to be a plastic bottle so the label was made from 100 percent recycled plastic um no china what made in china no china now nah china <laughs> it's, it is a bit of a booklet um so this is 100 percent viscose which i'm surprised at because it's called cotton on and i thought it was going to be cotton well, don't I look foolish now? Okay. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> but 
but it's very very cute um definitely a bit lighter looking than the black maxi dress um interested to see how this kind of fits on my lumps and bumps and curvy worvies um i did i did get this in a 28 didn't i yes no a 24 sorry well this is a 24 um because they only go up to a 24 so yeah that is the maxi uh, so mum said i look like i'm from out of bridgerton and then i told her that it's an australian brand so i guess this is what they would wear in bridgerton australia um so yeah pleasantly surprised i thought this maxi could have actually been too tight but it's actually kind of just skimming away from me um yeah it's really pretty quite different especially when you compare it to the black maxi dress from earlier um this is a lot kind of softer and lighter and brighter and the only thing i found surprising is it's not cotton it's viscose which i like the brand's called cotton on mum so that's why i'm like that's weird If anyone has tried cotton, like if anyone's from Australia and knows more about the brand, let me know because that's just like, just find that strange. Um, but it is really, really pretty, and I think I will try more from this brand going forward. Now I know how it fits; it fits quite true to size, um, and it's a lovely length. And I feel like a lot of maxis, they just kind of go like out, whereas this one actually is a bit more like form fitting it's not like it's not enormous so yeah really pretty i think it was on the sale so that's convenient <laughs> i like the neckline i think that looks pretty yeah and you can tie yeah. that as yeah. well if you've got a bigger smaller bust mm. but i quite like how it mm. very nice it's very nice so guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thought it was something a little bit different. Oh, my hair's, my hair's getting in the way. <laughs> Thought it was just something a little bit different to my ASOS regular hauls. Um, just put me out of my comfort zone a little bit, trying things that I wouldn't have done before. Obviously, they didn't go crazy. They didn't pick out PVC or something. Um, but yeah, just for it was a bit of a different video. Let me know what you thought of it down below. Would you like me to try it again? See what ASOS picks for me. Um, let me know what your favourite piece was down below. And if you haven't yet, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, like button and leave me a comment. Hope you're all staying safe and well. And I'll catch you later. Bye.